Welcome, welcome, welcome to story time with me, Miss Sheila. I hope you're having a wonderful and beautiful day. There's a plane going ahead of me and a dog barking. <laughs> so I'm at my son's pool again, still in Florida and just loving it here. So I thought, and it's kind of like a garden like because he has big trees. And the story we're going to read today is called The Garden, The Curtain, and The Cross. Oh, sounds interesting. Let's get into it. In the beginning, God made people. He made a wonderful garden for them. Look at the beautiful garden. God lived there with them. And look at Adam and Eve. Eve, God's here. He wants to walk with us again. How cool is that? Oh, yee! I bet it's going to be even more amazing than yesterday. So there's Adam and Eve being excited to see God. So, but then, uh oh, do you know the story what happened? Let's find out. The people decided not to do what God said. This is sin. The people couldn't live with God anymore. Yeah, because look, the serpent um, tricked Eve and Adam. And they did something that they weren't supposed to. So then they got pulled and they had to leave the garden. God put angels in front of the garden. They were like a big keep out sign. Keep out, can't go in anymore. Oh no. So God came to live among people in a special building in the temple. But God put a big curtain around where he lived and it was a big keep out sign. See the, the cloth? So that's the big keep out sign curtain. And one day, God the Son came to live in the world as a person, baby Jesus. And he was called Jesus. And Jesus loved his Father God. And Jesus always did what his Father said. Thank you, Jesus. But Jesus died on the cross, and it was very sad. But when he died, he took all our sins from us. And then something amazing happened. Look at what do you think happened? Let's find out. The temple court curtain tore. God had ripped up the keep out sign. Hallelujah. Look at it tore right in half. And Jesus came back to life. And he lives in heaven forever. There's Jesus and he came back to life for us. For you and me. And he goes, because Jesus died, we can be friends with God. And look at, there's Jesus on the horse saying, come, come friends, come. And we can live with God forever in his wonderful place. And Jesus says, God says it's wonderful to live with him, but because of your sin, you can't come in. But I died on the cross to take away your sins, so all my friends can now come in. Let's say thank you, King Jesus. Thank you, thank you. You're amazing, King Jesus. Woohoo! We love you, we love you, we love you. Wow, I so hope you enjoyed that story. And I hope you remember that God loves you so, so much that he sent his son Jesus to come and to be with us and live with us right in our hearts. Until next time, we're three, Miss Sheila. Keep shining your light bright. Bye for now.